So now that you're in edge of typing, what do you do now? The screen, your screen should look similar to this, and there's a lot of stuff here. But on the left hand side is your menu, and our objective for fourth quarter is to complete these three sections here. And so it starts out with middle row keys, top row, and bottom row. And then you go to words and sentences, and that has several lessons and numbers and letters review. These are the only three sections that we are that we want to complete during fourth quarter. If you get a chance to move further than that, then my suggestion is to go to the practice library, choosing your own adventure or making headlines. Any of those three are pretty good for more practice. How much should you be completing? What we usually do is these sections here, so I'm in letters and common symbols, and the first section is middle row keys. We usually do this section in one week. Then you have top row keys, and we do that section in one week. And then we do bottom row keys, and we do that section in one week. So that would be three weeks. If we go to words and sentences, it's a similar thing, typing words with all rows one week typing capital letters one week, and typing complete sentences one week. And then numbers and letters review, learning numbers one week, and then the review uh, is really just a larger section, so that could take the last two weeks. And that's nine weeks altogether. And that's how long we have in our quarter. I'm going to click on this one so you can kind of see what it looks like. You will see when it comes up, it says type the D key. So what am I supposed to use to type the D key with? And that's what these hands down here are for, is to show you. And you see here that it's using the middle finger. And you see where the fingers are positioned at. You need to make sure that your fingers are in this position. You should not be taking one finger and hitting the D key. Your hands have to be in this position. It's up to you to do that. So I'm going to type the D key now, and now I can hit enter, and now it's going to give me letters to type. And so I'm going to type D, 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 D. And it does that, and you can come and click on continue down here, or you can just hit the enter button. Sometimes they will show a video. It is very important to watch the videos. Please do not skip them. Watch the videos usually are only one to two minutes long, but they have good information. So please watch a video if a video pops up in between the lessons. And so now we'll go with K. And now you will type. And you can see that at the bottom it shows your hands and it shows what uh, key you should be typing. So it goes spacebar with your thumb and then D again, spacebar, K, spacebar, K, and so forth. And you get the idea. It's not, it's not super hard. It's practice though. And remember, the whole idea of doing this is to develop muscle memory. And so if you practice it the correct way, then you'll make progress. If you don't practice it the correct way and use the correct fingers, you're really just wasting your time. You're just wasting your time. So please, please put your fingers in the correct places and uh, use the correct fingers as you see on the keyboard. Use the correct fingers for the correct keys.